know, for those of you who know me, I know some of you do, Mike Stoller does, um, you might, I have a pedigree, okay, I do. And um, Moon River got us out of the valley to the west side. <laughs> um, and Peter Gunn, Peter Gunn started the move, that got us the boat. Um, it was called the gunboat. And if, if you, one thing that my dad was not good at was driving a car and driving a boat. So the gunboat was, you know, it was an effort, but it, it didn't last long. But once we moved to the west side, it was, it was a, a total revelation. Those of you who do know me, I have a twin sister, Monica, very talented lady. But, <laughs> really, okay, good, yes. No, I, I love her, we're, we're very close, um, much to Bob's chagrin, but that's, <laughs> that's another story. Uh, we go to therapy for that. Um, <laughs> but, um, you know, with most twins, uh, there's a good twin and an evil twin. I am the good twin. <laughs> my sister Monica is the evil twin. So my experience with rock and roll and, you know, the, the edginess of rock and roll and all that, really, I was, I was dragged along by my sister. Um, and, and my brother, to some degree, he's in another category. He was, he was like the Barney's Beanery person, <laughs> you know. It's like we don't, we don't talk about him, but, uh, but he was definitely into rock and roll. And my God, Dr. Demento, this was like, this was, this was our youth. But so my sister actually really has the better stories because um, I was the one who was in college in the University of Denver getting the call from my dad <laughs> saying, did you know your sister is on the tour bus with the nitty-gritty dirt band going to Walla Walla, Washington? <laughs> I said, no. I said, how could you not know that? So anyway, she did these things. Um, she was the one who hung out at CBS Studios uh, on Sunset Boulevard, stalking the um, Paul Revere and the Raiders. <laughs> and she and Mark Lindsay have their own stories. So, you know, I, I, w I was a good Catholic girl. I went to Marymount High School for two years until we got kicked out because of the evil twin. <laughs> um, she just was not asked back, let's put it that way. And y if, you, if you have friends who are twins or you know twins, you're tight. You don't want to leave. So I went with her to the funky, you know, high school where... Dean Martin's kids went, and John Provost, who was Timmy on Lassie, went, and and Jay North, who was um, Dennis. no Dennis the Menace. I mean uh, Jimmy Connors. All these all these people who didn't quite fit in. Um, that's where I ended up in high school after going to Marymount, and my sister dragged me. So going to. Uh, Ricky Martin's 21st birthday party. <laughs> so we're sitting there. Elton John, John Lennon with May Pang. <laughs> yep, yep. Liz, Liz Taylor with David Bowie. Yeah. I mean, this is the kind of life that my sister dragged me into. <laughs> so I, I am grateful to Monica. She's a, she's a great person. But... Um, you know, I was more a, a carpenter's girl where my dad was listening to Pink Floyd, okay? <laughs> so I, I, I'm here by default. I will tell you uh, my own experience. Um, when I was in college in Denver, uh, it was, I was a freshman, and uh, it was Christmas. So what do you get your parents? I wrote them a poem, and I called it Sometimes. And my dad loved the poem, they were blown away, and he decided to write a little melody to my poem. And he got Sally Stevens, who's a studio singer, a lot of people know Sally, to go into RCA and, uh, and record a little demo of, of Sometimes. And in the next studio recording were the Carpenters. And they were looking for the final cut on their album, they didn't have it. And my dad just happened to play in the demo, this little s song called Sometimes. 
and they loved it. They put it on the album. I got my first check from ASCAP. It was, it was like $14,000. I was, I was beside myself. So uh, this, was my, this was my experience growing up, and lots of stories. If we do this again, you all come back. I'll have my sister come. <laughs> And she can really blow your minds with, with, with some things. But, but for now, that's, that's what I would like to share. And I thank you all for being here very much. And who's next?